Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Blinding Visit Rebirth. Today I'm going to talk about the first Devil Deal. So, um, if you don't know, the first Devil Deal works in a very, very uh, unique way, I guess, compared to everything else. So when you start on a run, you basically, when you go to the second um, level, so the basement 2 or the cellar 2, you are given a 100% chance of getting your Devil Deal. So, the big thing here is, is this, and this is what you want to do, because when you first start a run, um, Devil Deals can be a very good source of getting yourself um, damage ups, so you really want to get yourself the first Devil Deal. So to get to get that, all you have to do is this. And it might sound a little harder to those who are quite new to the game, but it is this. Do not take Red Heart damage. So if you take Red Heart damage, you will not, uh, well, not necessarily not earn the Devil Deal, but your chance to get a Devil Deal will go down. So. Theoretically, there is always a chance you can get the Devil Deal, whether you take all the damage in the world or you don't take a damage, any damage at all. But, obviously the chance is a lot lower. So, in the Binding of Isaac, Wrath of the Lamb, we had all the different uh, percentages down pat. So, if it is the same, if you take Red Heart damage in the boss fight of the second floor, you will only have a 1% chance to get your Devil Deal. So, as you can see, I am on Basement 2, I've Cursed the Blind, which is terrible for finding a devil deal, but I have not taken any red heart damage in this floor. Now I can take soul heart damage, that's fine. Take soul heart damage is not going to affect my deal. Only red heart damage will affect it. So, or eternal hearts, that'll affect it too. So as you can see here, I've nearly done here with, with Monstro, and I'm going to get myself a devil deal. There it is. And I can go in there. With my not knowing what it is and get myself a guppy's hairball and a horror Babylon. But that's how you do it. So basically all it is is that you in the first floor you really want to focus on getting your soul hearts if you can. So find tinder rocks, prioritize them, use them, get yourself to soul hearts and get through the second uh, boss fight as soon as possible. And if you can, if you have the D6, make sure you have a roll up. Curse of Blind doesn't help, but you want to make sure you have your soul hearts or black hearts and that way you'll get your devil deal guaranteed. If you get hit with red heart damage, then that means you've got a lower chance of getting it, and you most likely won't get it. Uh, especially if you take the red heart damage in the boss room. You can, I believe, still use the beggars and um, slot and the heart donation machines. That was in the old Isaac, I'm not 100% sure on the new Isaac how, how that affects the um, devil deal chance, but it used to be fine. Um, but just worry about getting to your boss room without taking any damage at all, and then go back and do that kind of stuff, like checking your curse rooms and using the devil beggars. That way, you can get yourself your Devil Deal, hopefully get your better items, get your guppies and your broomstones, and then you can win your run. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.